And the time starts now. For the next hour, I will be playing as many geography-based quizzes as I can possibly get through. And as you can see, I've got so many lined up. I'm excited for this, but to make it even more difficult, we are not allowed to edit anything out. So if I have to catch my breath because I'm talking too quickly, that stays in the final video. As to things like voice cracks or stutters or just me saying something that's really embarrassing, that all stays in, so I need to watch what I say. We are, however, still doing all of the usual editing stuff, such as face cam, and then full screen, and then obnoxious background music, and then back to face cam, then full screen, then back to face cam, then maybe wiggle the face cam around a bit. Editor Kai still has to do that for the next hour, of course, but I can't cut out any of the things that I say or do for the next hour. Let's get on with the very first quiz, which is Complete the Map Snippet XV. Is that 15? Okay. Can you complete the map by naming each country and territory that would appear within the area of the map snippet? So that's quite tricky because apparently I have 18 countries to name in two minutes. So I need to concentrate. Right. First quiz of the video for the next hour. <laughs> Let's get on with it. Right. Western Sahara. So uh, around that would be Mali. And I guess we're going to have the Guineas and Guinea-Bissau and Senegal. Do you think I can get them all? Uh, Gambia will be in there. Ooh, um, <laughs> think about it. Burkina Faso, I would assume, would be in there. Are we going to have Togo? Is that going to sneak in? Yeah, so then we're going to also have Ghana and uh, Benin. And then uh, Nigeria? And Yeah, Nigeria and Niger. So there you go. That's 12-18 that we got quite quick. What's after that? Iberia, I think. Oh, no. So there's something else that goes in here. What is it? I can't remember. Oh, God. Uh, Gabon? No, no, no. Think. And then we've also got this area above Mali, which is going to be... Oh, it's it's difficult thinking of that portion of Africa. Is Morocco's not going to be... No, no, no. And I don't think Tunisia is either. Okay. Mali. Um, Algeria's going to sneak up at the top. But what's here? 14 of 18. I don't think I'm going to get all of these, but I've got a really nice start. Oh, come on. What is it? What is it? What is it? Think, Jack. Think. Normally, these kind of thinking moments would be cut out, but it all stays in today. Ghana. Have I not got Burkina? Oh, I have got Burkina Faso. Right. Okay. Um, da, da, da. I can't think. I've got so many good ones there, but oh, it's going to be something really obvious. Have we, have we done Libya? No, Libya's not in it. And Algeria I've already done. Uh, I don't think I'm going to get the final four. Something here, something here. Oh! Cape Verde. Uh, Ivory Coast. That's that big one. Um, that's that's a nice amount. But what's that? Oh, I don't know. Is it Sail Tome and Principe? Is that going to be in? No, it's not. Okay, right. Fine. 16 of 18 is solid. That's fine. What did I miss? I missed Mauritania. And Sierra Leone. Okay, that's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm proud of 16 out of 18. Would have been nice to get the first one of the video all 100%, but whatever, forget about it. Next, we move on to country. So there's a random country. We got some info on it. I have to work out what it is by naming other countries. So we'll just do United Kingdom to begin with. Let's do it and enter. Okay, so the country is in the Northern Hemisphere, just like United Kingdom. It's also European, so that narrows it down. But it is southeast of the UK, and it's got a smaller population, and it's slightly hotter. So it's probably going to be Mediterranean, smaller population. I guess I'll just try Italy then in that case. Let's see how we get on. Okay, it's east of Italy, still a smaller population, and it's hotter? Ooh, do you think... Should I go with Greece? Greece is probably a bit hotter. Oh, no. Okay, right. Th th um, it's southeast of Crete. Is it Turkey? I'll just keep moving my way east. Let's try it. It is not Turkey. Wait, Turkey's being classed as Asia. Okay, that that's fine. Um, south of Turkey? So, is it going to be Cyprus then? A little cheeky fella. It was Cyprus. Okay, fair enough. That one went okay. That's respectable. We move on now to Flags of Oceania. Right. So it's quite simple, this one. I just have to name all 14 flags of the continent of Oceania, which I should be able to do. So to begin with, 
I can't actually remember the first one. It'll come to me. It'll come to me. I'm not skipping. That, that timer can go down. I don't care. I've got all the time in the world. Um. <laughs> okay. We'll come back to it. We'll come back to it. I know all of the others. Oh, God. That's so annoying. Solomon Islands. Uh, Marshall Islands. And Kiribati. Spelled Kiribati. That's going to be New Zealand. Followed by Fiji. Followed by Nauru, I think that is. Followed by Australia and Tonga. Yep. Uh, Vanuatu. Vanuatu. Uh, Tuvalu. Papua New Guinea. Actually, I'm going to try something. I think someone said you can put PNG. Ah, I've been lied to. Right, that's fine. Papua New Guinea. Is that all right? Am I spelling Papa wrong? I often do that. Yeah, there you go. Then we've got... Palau, yep, yeah, it came to me, Micronesia, literally, the only one I didn't know, just basically instantly, is the first one, what is it, I've got two minutes, that's all the time that I need, and unfortunately today, you have to just sit and watch with me as I struggle, what is that, there's something, how did I learn this, something to do with the, the shape that it creates of the stars, that was something to do with my mnemonic, but I've just forgotten it, Solomon Islands, Marshall Islands. Is there another one? Micronesia, Nauru, Vanuatu. Oh, I don't know. Okay, do you know what? We'll give up. What is it? Samoa! It's just Samoa. Okay, that's fine. Right, have we already been going for seven minutes? Is this video seven minutes long? That's so crazy. I feel like I've done nothing yet. It just shows how much his edit is out normally. My god, right. Reveal map. Guess the country five. Can you identify the country or countries featured on the map by typing random countries to reveal sections of the map? Yes. Yes, I can. So you, this will make sense. I type in random countries until I see more of the map and then eventually I should know what that country is. Uh, USA, ooh, I don't know, um, Brazil. So these aren't what my guesses are. I'm just naming countries at this stage until I see a bit more. Uh, Cambodia, can't... <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, basically then I felt like the words, I think I saw Bayo Lock and I thought it kind of looks Asian. Um, so the first Asian country I thought of was Cambodia, which just so happens to actually be the correct answer. Well, that went better. Cool. Next one. God, we're going to be done in shorter than an hour if I keep up this speed. Oh, this will slow me down. Countries of Asia. An absolute classic on the Jack Sucks of Geography channel. Literally just have to sit here and name all 49 countries of Asia. Get ready for some thrilling content. Here we go. Uh, China, Russia, uh, Kazakhstan, uh, Turkey. I don't know why I'm throwing them around in such a random order. Mongolia. Uh, what's going to be frustrating this video is watching me type unedited. I'm very, very sorry about that. North Korea. Uh, let's do Japan. Let's do Taiwan. Uh, let's do Timor Leste. Didn't expect me to whack out Timor Leste so early, did you? Gonna do a couple of other small ones that I often get wrong. Singapore, uh, Brunei. Um, what else should I? Can I get? Qatar. We'll do now. We'll do Bahrain. I've often forgot Bahrain. Bhutan isn't that small, but I want to get it out the way. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Right, we'll do some more big dogs again after the Maldives. So, which way shall I go? We've got all the time in the world. We'll start over here. So, I'm going to do Azerbaijan, which I always have to think about to type. There you go. Azerbaijan, Georgia, Syria, Jordan. Um, what else have we got in there? We've got Palestine. We've got Israel. We have also got Saudi Arabia. There you go. And Oman and Yemen. Yep. Uh, what's that fella there? Is that Iraq? It is. And then Iran is next to it. Oh, who have I got there? That's concerning. That Armenia. It's um. Is it? Yeah, it is Armenia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank God for that. Right. Should we do the stands? Afghanistan and Turkmenistan and Uzbekistan. And uh, let's do it. Let's get it out the way. It's got to happen at some point. Kyrgyzstan. Yes. Spelled it right first time. Uh, Tajikistan. Is that the last stan? 
Pakistan as well, Pakistan. There you go. Stan means land, I learned recently. Kind of obvious, really, when you think about it. Okay, India, uh, Sri Lanka. We are blasting through this. I'm curious if I'm going to just absolutely screw it up. Nepal, Bangladesh. There you go. Uh, let's do Myanmar. Come on, very nice. And yet, yeah, now we'll do Cambodia, our friend. Uh, Laos, Thailand, Taiwan I've already done. Vietnam's that little stringy fella next to it. Okay, then Indonesia. This is just, we're, we're flying. Malaysia, go on. 45 of 49, we've done in about two and a half minutes, apparently. Fair enough, I'll take it. Philippines, so I think it's only 1L. There you go. And now it looks done. Oh, no, no, there we go. Cool. UAE, very nice. Two left, one of them's there. So what have I not got? Bahrain and Qatar I've got. Oh no, see this is what happens. This is what always happens. <laughs> and where's the other one as well? Worried about that. Oh, hang on, hang on. It's, it's up there. What is that? Lebanon. Lebanon. There you go. So now it's literally just this fella. Bahrain, Qatar. Brunei I've got. I always get stuck here in the Middle East. Oh, it's going to be obvious as well. It's not Burundi. That's in Africa, Jack. Get Burundi out of your head, please. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, why does this always happen? Who are you? It's, it's under Iraq. Bahrain, Qatar. Bahrain, Qatar, UAE. Oh, no. No, no, no. And I'm so conscious that all of this stays in the video. And what are we on? We've got 47 minutes left. What should we go with? Let's give ourselves one more minute to try and think of it. I imagine a few of you out there are screaming at me. Others are as clueless as I am. And some of you are probably already asleep, which is fine. I'll take the watch time. What is that? Brute. Ba Bahrain, Brunei, UAE, Qatar, Qatar, Bar. Okay, I give up. Put me out of my misery. Kuwait, it's Kuwait. Why Kuwait? Why are you let me down like that? Well, it, it's not your fault, Kuwait. I, I won't hold it against you. Okay, we move on to GeoGuessr Flags of the World, but we're playing Blink Mode. So I'm actually only going to get to see each round for two seconds. I would have done one second, but when I tested it, my internet doesn't really load for the first second. So I can't actually see anything. So I might not even get to see the flag in time. Start game, I only have to... Okay, that's fine. We'll go again. Right, there it is. Uh, oh, right. that's That was Quebec, I think. So is Ottawa in Quebec? I, th I think that was the Quebec flag. I, I thought this was national flags, but we got a regional one to begin with, so that's a, that's a bit of pressure for me. Let's just guess. Yes, Quebec City I should have gone with, but we're close enough there that, that I'm happy with that. So let's play the next one. Oh, oh no! It's another regional flag! I've been absolutely goosed! <laughs> oh no! Um, I feel like I've seen that in... Have I seen that in Cyprus before? That's not Cyprus, it's over here, Jack. Yeah, I, I I don't know. I think this is just, it's just in my head somewhere. So we'll go Nicosia, Cyprus. Completely wrong. Where was that? It's a, it's a regional flag within Spain, apparently. Right. I was not ready for regional flags. I am rubbish at regional flags. We got lucky with Quebec. Let's see it. Where is it? <laughs> I don't think I saw the flag. I, I saw a bit of blue and a bit of red. So, I'll go Moscow, why not? <laughs> what? I did not see the Liechtenstein flag! Oh no, this is going horribly. More regional flags! <laughs> oh, I need national flags, not... Oh no! Um, see, as well, because I'm just focused on trying to find the flag and recognise it, I don't take in anything else either. Wow, this is, this is trouble. I am in trouble here. Um, we'll go Paris. Why not? 
Okay, it was an area of Ukraine apparently. Right, well, let's do the next one. Okay, I saw a Bangladesh flag for a moment. I also saw some other flags, but that is all I have time for. So let's guess it. Are, are you kidding? What? 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 I'm sorry. I'm. I'm sorry. What? Where? Where is that? I, not. What? This is just. Look at that. That was an absolute. <laughs> it was an absolute disaster. Oh my god! I. I uh, that was going to be my safe round where I was going to look really cool with my little blink mode two seconds. Oh, this is the worst. <laughs> no. Oh, flags of the world really let me down there because I was not ready for regional flags every single round. That's fine, though. We'll play largest countries. Oh, I don't think I'm going to get a full 30, but I feel like we can do okay here. So let's uh, just start with the obvious one, which is Russia. We'll try and go in order. Uh, Canada... USA, and then, uh, is it Indonesia? No, Indonesia's 15th. What's after Russia? Uh, do, do you know what? Forget the order thing. I'm just going to name ones that I know are in the top 30. So, Mongolia, Kazakhstan, um, sticking in that area. China's fourth, obviously. Then I think it's Brazil, fifth. Yes, it is. Okay. Uh, Mexico, I know, is up there, as is... Um, see, when you get to number 30, you are going to have some smaller countries in there. Argentina. Okay, Argentina pretty high at 8. We can also whack in... What else do I want to go? There's a map of the world there, but I'm not looking at it. Don't worry, I'm not cheating. Um, we've got 10 of 30, which is a nice start. So now let's try Papua New Guinea. Papua New Guinea not even up there. Australia is obviously going to be there. Should have said that one. I feel like... Is Madagascar... I know it's... I think it's the largest island. But is it big enough to be on the list? No, it isn't. Okay. Right. Work my way around. Let's do... Venez oh, I haven't done any of the African ones. Libya. Uh, Algeria. And... Chad. Sudan's pretty big. So then where do I want to go? Do I want to try, like, Kenya? No. Okay. We've got half of them. It is harder than you think this, you know. Um, Kazakhstan. Have I done Mongolia? Yeah, we've done Mongolia. We've done China. Is Japan going to be on there? Of course it is, a Jack, you fool. You're an imbecile. Ukraine? Oh, God. Um, go back to Africa, Jack. Think of, think of that one because it's just such a large consonant. So we're probably going to have Niger and then Nigeria as well. No. Okay, just Niger. Let us try Venezuela. Oh my god, this is difficult. 16 of 30. I honestly thought I'd be better at this. There's going to be so many really obvious ones that I'm just missing. Iran. Yep. Cool. That's that's good. That's nice. Saudi Arabia is going to be probably in the first half. It is. That's good. That's what we like to see. So from there... India, man, come on. Yeah, India's seventh largest, and I hadn't said it. We have the full top ten, though, which is nice. Um, so from there, could we do... Oh, God, this is so difficult. And I know there's just going to be so many obvious ones. Is Germany going to creep in? No, it isn't. I think after Russia, second largest is... Don't quote me on this, but Ukraine looks big in comparison. So we're not going to have, like, Norway or, or is Sweden going to be? No. What is going on? I think I need to bail out of Europe. And I think at this point I can bail out of North America, right? Around the equator, we do have Ecuador. No. What on earth are all of these countries? What's bigger than Saudi Arabia? There's two countries out there that are larger. Argentina we've done. Does Chile add up? It doesn't. Oh my god. Right, I've got four minutes left. I'm going to move over to Asia again and just kind of focus in on that area. So, I just feel like we've got all of the obvious ones from Asia. Like, I've just looked at a map of Asia. And it's just... Malaysia? No. Philippines? Nothing takes up that much space. 
What is going on? What? <laughs> this is so difficult. I've got four minutes. At least we've got two thirds of them. That's so weird though. Let, let, let's just try a few. Yeah, South Africa, right. Mozambique. No. Uh, Botswana. I know what will be there. Namibia. Namib. Yeah. Namib. No, I guess not. Angola then? Yeah. Okay. Um, DRC, isn't that? DRC's on there. Did not expect the. I thought DRC was quite a bit smaller than that, I will be honest with you. Uh, that was me looking that I was recording, by the way, as opposed to cheating. Right. After DRC, we can have. South Sudan's not going to be there, right? It's just. I just. I don't want to rule anything out, to be honest. Mali. Nice. Mauritania. Africa is the key here. Look at that. I've just. Oh, look at that. We've only got six missing. That's that's far more respectable. Um, so stay in Africa. We can also whack in Cameroon. No. Uh, I've done Madagascar. Zambia. Zimbabwe. No. I wonder where they're going to be. I just feel like I've got everywhere in Asia, but I bet I'm missing somewhere obvious. Peru's not... Peru, is there? Peru is much bigger than I think. Um, Denmark. Denmark, because it's counting Greenland. There you go. Look at that. Right, 26 of 30. Much nicer. Of course, Denmark. See, Europe, there was a little cheeky fella in there. And I bet people knew that. I assume Spain's not... Yeah, I, I, I wanted to just try it, all right? Don't, don't judge me for that one. Um, so from there... I just feel like we've got all of the big dogs in Africa now. So where else can we go? <laughs> We're not going to have anywhere else in uh, Oceania. North America, I've already kind of... Because we're not going to have things like Cuba, are we? No. Or, or Haiti. J definitely not. So it's just going to be Asia and Africa, really. DRC, which we've already got. So back to Asia. Let's try Vietnam. Cambodia. That, these are terrible answers. Thailand might... Oh, no, it's not. And I've already tried Japan. I'm not going to try either of the Koreas. I've done India. We've done... A, I feel like we've... What are these countries? Mauritania. It's got to be in Africa then. We've got a final minute. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I, I honestly don't know. 26 of 30 is fine, though. Like, I, I'm pleased with that score, but I would <laughs> I would have loved to get them all. What's going to be a similar size to Mauritania? They're going to be so obvious, aren't they? At least we literally have the top 25 largest countries. Like, that's, that's quite nice to be able to do. Obviously, I did have to throw a few other guesses in there. But come on, what is it? <laughs> it's really bothering me. We're going to find out in 40 seconds. But I cannot believe it. How long have we been recording? 36 minutes. Very, very nice. That is what I like to see. I can't believe I'm 36 minutes into a, a full video. Right. 30 seconds left. Is there anywhere else I can get? Just name random countries, Jack, and see what happens. No, none of these are going to be on there, but I, I'm just hoping it'll trigger something. Cameroon. Gambia. Gabon. Uh... Mauritius. No, don't name island countries, Jack. Come on, don't stoop so low. In fact, let's just count down from seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one. What did I miss? Let me know. Colombia. Right, fair enough. Ethiopia. Egypt. Okay, of those four that I missed, Egypt's the one I'm annoyed about. Because looking at Egypt, it's quite obvious that it's as large as some of these other fellas. Okay, that's fine. We, um, it was... Actually, two countries in South America and two countries in Ethiopia. I did try players like Venezuela. I don't know why I didn't try Colombia. But anyway, we move on. We're back on GeoGuessr, but we are doing a Fun With Flags quiz as opposed to something else. So, flags, flags, flags. Let's do it. I have not played this before, I don't think. Perhaps I have. This is part of which flag? Mark it on the map. Okay, that's fine. So, I just click that little fella and we guess. That was a little bit of the Canadian flag. I'm going to click the space button. Yeah, easy, easy. Don't even worry about it. Okay, round two of 17. This is part of which flag? That is going to be 
Spain, please. There you go. Oh, very nice. Thank you. So I, uh, if I take too long, I'll start losing points. But 5,000 is the max. Select the pin. We can easily get a perfect score in this, surely. That's Cambodia. So just down there and guess. Still 5,000 points. Very respectable. Let's do the next one. Yep. Yeah. I'm ready. Go on, go on. Uh, oh, that's Welsh flag. Click. Guess. Not often that Welsh get some recognition uh, because it's normally just kind of bundled into the rest of the UK. There it is. Wales flag. Very, very cool flag. Select the pin. Round 5 of 17. Don't mind if I do. Let's see what happens. Ooh, Laos, I'm guessing. Yes. Nice. Good. Definitely a little bit harder. So I might actually start to worry if, uh, if they're all getting more difficult. We'll see what happens though. We're on round 6 of 17. Margaret on the flap. Ah, Morocco. Morocco, Morocco. Yes. I, I always get Morocco and Tunisia mixed up, so that was a little bit scary when they were both there. But we're fine. The way that I learnt this flag is kind of, you see all of the holes in the star. I think of Morocco has lots of O's in it. <laughs> it's just how I learned it, by the way. I'm not saying you should as well. So I think of all of the holes in the O's, and I think of all of the holes in the star as well. But that probably only works for my brain. All right, let's see if you can pick out the correct flag from these manipulated options. Oh my god, and then there's a scary fella looking at us. Right, well, we'll see what happens. Round 7 of 17, uh, which is the Mexican flag. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, D. No, it's B, isn't it? <laughs> I got psyched out. I got psyched out. I wanted a perfect score. Oh no, that's so sad. All right, that's fine. That's our only one. All right, correct flag is C. That's easier. Yeah. Oh, God, Mexico. You let me down there. I, I let myself down. I'm sorry for blaming you, Mexico. Australian flag. Uh, a D. There you go. I reckon if I'd left that any longer, I'd have started losing points. We go again. Round 10 of 17. Can't believe I got wrong, Mexico. Uh, a. Don't overthink it, Jack. Yeah. Just see it and click it. Because that's what I did with, with Mexico. I overthought it. And everything went downhill. Mexico doesn't have text on it. Uh, how many stars? There's, how many stars are... Uh, six. Four? Well, there's... Uh, is that including the one that was there? Because that's what threw me off. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, next up, we're combining two flags into one. Whoa, okay, then let's, let's do it. 12 of 17. It's going okay. Vietnam's flag and uh, <laughs> Somalia, right? Yeah, that was a weird one. I've not seen anything like that before. Yeah, okay, so two very similar flags. I was thinking Palau because of the colour scheme, because it's it's blue and yellow. So that was a little bit of a gamble. But we're next. Uh, Bhutan's flag and Bangladesh's flag with the circle. You will see an explanation now. Look at that, Bhutan, Bangladesh. It creates quite a cool looking flag, to be fair. Not bad. Round 14 of 17. This is Ivory Coast flag and... Nigeria? Ah, oh, Ireland, because the colour. Let me, let me see, let me see. What do you mean? See, I went with Nigeria because Nigeria's shapes are more like that, I think. Whereas these have got a wider middle. But maybe that, maybe that is actually wrong. Oh, that's that. Whatever. Whatever. I feel like this is a bit difficult, this, because you could find different aspects. Czechia's flag and Cuba's flag with the star. Yeah, that one I can see. But we get to see it. We've got a star right there that gets added on, and it's red as well. All right. Next one, round 16 of 17. This is Greece's flag and Georgia. Yeah. Because it's the, the Georgia cross type things. Yeah, those little cool symbols. And that, once again, also creates quite a believable-looking flag. Okay, I think this is the final one, so it's going to be tricky, presumably. Kyrgyzstan's flag and Poland or Indonesia or Singapore. Um, Poland. No, it's Indonesia, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that was a really tricky one, because Pol Poland... There we go. First voice crack. That can't be cut out. Poland, Singapore, and Indonesia all have very similar-looking flags. Um, yeah, there's the breakdown. So I just, that was obviously Indonesia. I don't know why I went with Poland. 
Oh my god, right, we got 65,000 out of 85,000, which is respectable, but, you know, it's okay, it's okay. Let's uh, play, I'm going to skip that one for now, because it's a little bit similar to what we've just done. Pixel Art Asian Flag 3. So what I have to do is name Asian countries, such as Japan, and every time I do so, it reveals more of a pixelated flag, and then I have to guess what that flag is. So we'll also name... Uh, North Korea and South Korea and then what are we getting there I think that's gonna be Bhutan isn't it um, so in order to enter Bhutan I have to put the hashtags easy easy did I get it that does this mean I did, am I wrong <laughs> I think this means I'm wrong and this is a good as a mile yeah I'm wrong it's not Bhutan I just saw the orange and the yellow Okay, well, let's keep going then. I'll enter Bhutan, then Japan, then North Korea, South Korea, China. I want to reveal more of this flag. We need to work out what I did wrong there. Um, India, it's Sri Lanka. That little bit of green has confirmed it for me. So let me uh, put that Sri Lanka and then the other one. There it is. That's more like it. Yeah, I let myself down there. But we redeemed ourselves. <laughs> okay, next we're going to do Pizza USA. Can you name any state within the highlighted pizza slice? And I only have 30 seconds to do so. So this is probably going to be quite tricky because even my typing uh, will let me down when I've only got 30 seconds. Let's do it. Let's do it. Play the quiz. All right. Um, Wyoming? Is that up there? No, it's not. Well, that's a great start. Uh, New York's in that one, though. Then we've also got Florida in that one. Florida. <laughs> Why am I typing so slow? Let's do Texas. Let's do Oklahoma. Let's do New Mexico. Uh, a little bit of California. Oh, no, no, no. Um, Utah. And uh, Montana. Oh, I didn't get to it in time. But there we go. Uh, Montana would have been fine if I was typing quick. But this one, I said Wyoming, and Wyoming is not in this chunk, so I would not have got, I did not get that one. Iowa, Michigan, Minnesota, Wisconsin. I need to remember that. That is something I definitely need to work my way up on. All right, color jumbled flags to anyone? Yes, please, Jack. Thank you very much. Okay, what is the correct flag of South Korea? <laughs> I'm psyching myself out. It's that one. Uh, St. Lucia, that one. This is quite similar to what we just did on Geogasa. That one, nice, it's going okay. Uh, Granada, Sierra Leone, the green one. Tanzania, that one I think, yes. Uh, Myanmar, oh, my first one I got wrong. Okay, Zimbabwe, that one, yep. Uganda, I can't even see what's different. That one, yep, good. Zambia, that one, yes, very nice. I think it's Nevis, this one? Oh, I was wrong. God, it's tricky when they're just like that. Marshall Islands. Um, Hungary is that one right? No! Oh no! Okay. Uh, Comoros. That's a tricky one. This one calling me though. It was that one. Okay. Seychelles. Can't get this wrong. Uh, very nice. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, what did we get there? We got 11 out of 15, 73%. Now that's what I call average. Well, that's really, really rude, actually. I'm actually quite upset about that. We'll move on. We're playing Time Guesser. So, you are shown a picture, and you have to work out where and when that picture was taken. And looking at this one, I can see the Belgian flag, but I don't know much about the history of Belgium. Uh, but Belgium. So, what we will do is we will just go to the capital of Belgium, which is Brussels. Uh, we'll see if we can find a square of some kind in the centre. Can we find any kind of centre? We found City Hall, so that would probably work. Uh, I will go there. And then I need to pick the year. We can zoom in. So, the colour, the type of the colour kind of reminds me of like that photo of Kennedy the day he died. So that was, that was like, that was some point in the 60s, wasn't it? So I might go a similar time. But looking at people's fashion... It could be later than the 60s, maybe. But everyone in the photo is quite old, so it's, it's a little tricky. It could even be, you know, the 80s or something. What should I go with here? 
Yeah, yeah. Do you know what? Should I stick with my first instinct? Yeah, I, the fashion looks kind of similar to what it is now, to be fair. So I feel like 60s is too early. So we'll go 85, and I'll make my guess. I was t oh, I did well there. My location. Yeah, I was 50 meters from the location, and I was only two years off. That's a really solid score. Let's play the next one. Ooh, okay. This one is going to be far, far worse. Is there anything we can read there? Butch, maybe? Maybe Butch Cassidy, that says? I don't know. Um, lights of... This is tricky. Look at those cars as well. This was from a while ago. But it's in colour. North-South trains use rapid something. So it's somewhere English speaking. B-O-N-O. -O. No, Bond. That's That says Bond. So it's Bond Street. I've heard of Bond Street, but I don't know even which country that is. It doesn't look like the UK. We... We... We bold? We Bond? We... We bold? We we the bold? I don't what is this? And then Unite Insurance. Ah, oh, so it's just it's Christmas in it's got a it's got a yellow taxi, so Christmas in New York. Should we see if we can find Bond Street in New York? Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Uh right, got my bearings. Bond. I see. Yeah, maybe it's not Bond Street. Maybe they're advertising James Bond. Who knows? We'll try and go to kind of like Times Square. Feels like that sort of area, doesn't it? To be honest, I might just click it. Because I don't think uh, there's any point in me wasting too much time on this. Because I just don't know it. So, yeah. Uh, oh, I need to pick the year though, don't I? Yes. Oh, God. Um, I don't know. The 50s, maybe? It's in colour, isn't it? Yeah, 55, why not? Make guess. It was the 70s and it was Chicago. A view of State Street, so it wasn't Bond Street. Taking atop a raised bridge in Chicago's transit system. Okay, well we got the country. That wasn't really a particularly good round, was it? Let's play the next one. Okay, this one I know. That would be uh, Moscow. Is it called St. Basil's Cathedral? So, <clears throat> let's see if we can find that. St. Basil's Cathedral, yes. Very nice. Um, so we're presumably here maybe, or maybe on the other side, but I think that'll, that'll be close enough. Kind of looks very Soviet Union, doesn't it, with these hats. Um, got a car over there. Ooh, tricky, to be fair. Looks chilly, doesn't it? What do we think? See, I, <laughs> I don't know much about Russian fashion. People might be dressed like this now, and I feel like they potentially are. But I also feel like that looks old. Like, look at those cars. Like, not crazy old, but it could be, it could be around the 80s again. Maybe. Shall I try that? Why not? Make guess. Four years off, 85, and it was Moscow, a little bit further down the road. That, once again, is a nice score. And we only have 21 minutes left. My goodness, 40 minutes we've been going. We've been having a fantastic time. Right, this one actually has a date on it. It says 89. We are loving the 80s. And it looks... Uh, wow, look at everyone. It looks... It, it, it actually looks before the 80s, but... I mean, it very clearly says... Oh, it could be a time capsule or something, though. That would really kind of throw us off. We'll, we'll have to go with 89, seeing as it says 89 on it. Can we read anything else? We've got a USA flag. And another USA flag there. Um, I can't see what that is, but it, this feels space related in some way. So we want to go maybe Houston, potentially. Is that is that a sensible thing to do? Or maybe, I don't know, look, look at the ruralness of it. I want to go in like Area 51. We'll go Houston. We'll go outside of Houston. I don't know. This is possibly a terrible guess. Uh, that just looks way too built up, but I, I don't know where else to go. And then we will do 89 as it says. So, 89, make guess. One year off, it was 1990. And where are we? Whoa! We are in Kazakhstan? My goodness! Ambassador Malai witnesses the elimination of the last Soviet short-range missiles. Whoa. Okay, fair enough. So... 
the the USA flags obviously throwing me off there. Right, our final round. Ooh, well this looks more recent. We've got Angela Merkel and Barack Obama, presumably. And he's sat on a bench. So, and, and look at where they are. That looks delightful. So this has got to be probably during his pres presidency, which was between 2008 and um, 2016, right? So... He's also got his grey hair, so we'll go further towards, you know, 2016, 20, 2015, 2014? I'll go 2015. Yeah, nice looking quality. Obviously, he might have even finished his presidency term by this point. Struggling to say that word, have you noticed? Uh, it looks like they're in Europe, I guess. Maybe. Although, I suppose I could be America, but America keeps losing me points. Um... Angela's from Germany, I think, but even that could be wrong. Switzerland, do they do they hold kind of environmental conferences around there? I, I think they, yeah, you know what, well yes, yes, Geneva. Should we go outside of Geneva, somewhere nice? Why not? Let's make the guess. We got it spot on, 2015! <laughs> okay, and it was back in Germany. Um... But I wasn't miles off. I actually, I'm quite pleased I got the year there. Well, yeah, we have a total score of 9,000 out of 10,000. So, in the end, 37k out of 50, which is respectable. And I really like this game. It's a, it's a shame when I've done videos on it. People don't seem to enjoy them. They get quite a lot less views. But, yeah, I really like that. Anyway, next, we are drawing a flag from memory. So, we are spinning the wheel. We have all countries to choose from. Very exciting. What's it going to be? It is South Sudan. Right, and as you can see, I've got paint ready to go. South Sudan is tricky, not going to lie. Um, because I always get these kind of flags wrong. So it's that's a little bit uneven, but it doesn't matter. Uh, I think, is it blue? Or is it green? I, I got this wrong in a recent video. I think I had to draw... North Sudan or just Sudan. Oh, let's go green and we'll we'll come back to it. And then from there it's stripes, isn't it? Oh god, let's get uh, black. I'm gonna I'm gonna let myself down on this one, I'll be honest. Yeah, something like that. And do you know what? I'm feeling the blue again. I'm gonna go back to the blue. And I even think there's a white star. I'm I'm sure I'm just gonna be drawing the wrong flag. Uh go on, go on, there it is. That's the wrong kind of star. We can make it a bit more accurate. I'm going to get this totally wrong, I'm sure. There you go. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and then it's kind of these standard colours of like black, red. No, not that. Red. Green. That's not right. Green. Gr oh, no. Now everything's going wrong. The colours I hit using Microsoft Paint for this very reason. Uh, <laughs> um, green, white. That's not right. It isn't right. Oh, now the black's all messed up. How do I keep getting this wrong? Is it is it black there? It's definitely not red in the middle, is it? Let's let, we can try it. I'm just gonna have to submit that, even though I know it's not right. <sighs> no, maybe maybe not. That's not right either. I'll try that. What else could? What other colours could there be? I feel like the black's throwing it off. Or is it the white? Oh, whatever, right. Let's reveal the actual flag of Sudan. If you give me one second to do so. Uh, normally it just gets edited in. But today... Ah, uh, okay. Right. Um, yeah, I, yeah, I really screwed... Oh, no, wait! I'm, I'm sorry, I'm looking at... The, I'm looking at South... I'm looking at North Sudan. South Sudan flag. Flag, wait for it. Yeah, there it is. And... Okay. Uh, the colours are correct. I needed a yellow star. I needed some white in the middle. Uh, I needed to put the red in the middle and the green. Yeah, basically, let's just give myself no points for that one. <laughs> okay, what a fun little round that was. We move on to A Countries by Outline. Let's do it. I know what the first one is. Awesome. Australia, there you go. All right, give me that next one. Oh my god. 
Um, Andorra, maybe. Let's try it. Yep, cool. That was that was a bit scarier than I was expecting. Armenia, potentially? No. Concerning. We'll, we'll skip it because we have a little time. Albania, I can get that one. What else? Oh, Algeria, potentially? No, okay. We'll come back. Uh, Austria, that is. There you go. What's our next one? I'm trying Armenia again. Nope, that's fine. Um, you know what? I'll try Algeria again too. Yes! Very nice. Ooh. What is that? Is it Azerbaijan? I feel like it is. Azerbaijan. Yes! Thank you. I don't know why I know that. That's Argentina. There it is. Very nice. Um, and then I think... Okay, I don't know that one. This one I'm guessing is Antigua and Barbuda. It is. Good. And now I think it's just the three, the four that I don't know. Oh, the three that I don't know. What is that? So, have we done Armenia yet? Yeah! <laughs> um, so now it's just these ones. What else, what else do we have that begins with A? Azerbaijan, Armenia, Albania, Afghanistan. That'll be this one. Afghanistan. Yes! I knew it, of course. Okay, right, there's literally just this one that I haven't got now. Albania, Algeria, Armenia. Have I done Armenia? Yes, I have. Okay, right, what we're going to do is we're going to give up. I did not get it. Angola. I should have known that. Okay, that's fine though. We play again around the perimeter of Ethiopia. Okay, starting with Sudan and moving clockwise, can you click Ethiopia's bordering, con bordering countries? I don't think I can, to be honest. I think I'm absolutely going to screw this up because I only get one attempt and 30 seconds. So starting with Sudan. There you go, then. Um, from Sudan, it would be... <laughs> oh, that's difficult. Djibouti? No! Right, we, we go again, we go again. Starting with Sudan. Eritrea, Djibouti. Yep, yeah, we're back on it. Somalia, Kenya, South Sudan. Right. Redeemed ourselves. Very nice. I will take it. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Staying in Africa, we've got Africa Bordering Country Challenge. Type... Uh, why have I got such a big quiz at this point in the video? <laughs> Type an African country which has a land border with another African country. And when entered the country and any bordering countries will fill in. So you have to try and name them all. Okay. So this will make sense. So if I tell like, Algeria... All of Algeria's bordering countries also get named. So basically the, the, the trick is to just type big countries. So Egypt, um, Ethiopia. There you go. We know that that will give us another six. We've already got 15 to 48 because of that. South Africa borders a lot of countries. Namibia will border a few. We've got 24. So it's just about getting there as fast as possible basically. Uh, what else can we do that's big? DRC is right in the middle. That's 31 of 48. Look at that. And then you're just going to end up with all the little stragglers. That's where it'll get tricky. So a different part of the world. Let's do Nigeria. Uh, that's 35. Okay, let's try Guinea. So I can't put Guinea. But I can put Guinea-Bissau. <clears throat> okay, and now that is just 10 left. And this is where it gets difficult. So where do I want to go from there? Cameroon, yep, that gives us eight left to get. See, do I, if if something like Madagascar doesn't border anything, Madagascar. So I guess it's not included. It's just the countries that do border at least something. So because of that, Eritrea I can't put because that borders Ethiopia, as we've just learned. Oh, just eight left. How would I name them? I don't know. I have uh, equatorial. Guinea. I'm trying it. Nope. Burkina Faso. I don't really have a strategy here. I'm just naming random countries. Right. Just four left to name. So I just need an area of Africa that isn't anywhere near any of the other places that I've already said. My god, I don't know. Um... <laughs> I can't think of anywhere that, that is in a totally different spot. Tunisia? Nope. Mali? Nope. It's gonna it's just gonna be some obscure places now. Um Botswana no 
Gabon. Gambia. Yes. So, Senegal. No. Just three left now. So, somewhere that isn't named. Is it in alphabetical order? Sorted from most bordering countries to fewest. Okay, so that makes sense. Interesting that there's two down there. I don't think I'm going to get it. I think I might have to end the quiz. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to end it and see what we missed out on. I've clicked end. <laughs> and it has not told me. No! <laughs> okay, well, uh, I guess we move on to the next quiz. Paint the flag 8. Can you guess the colours of this blank flag? Yeah, this is more my kind of thing. We have nine minutes of video left. Let's see how we get on. Right, what am I looking at there? Uh, ah, it's, it's Central African Republic. So I need a bit of blue. I need a bit of red. I need white. And I need... Is it green? Is that the last colour? I get it wrong if I don't say it. Yes! That was more like it. <laughs> that was far more fun. Okay. Oh, stats agrees. Higher or lower? This could take us to the end of the video if we do well. But we're only playing one round. What my country size? Right, okay. Poland or Jordan? Poland, definitely bigger. Look at this, I have a high score of 20 already. I do not think I'm going to beat that right now. Uh, Nigeria is definitely bigger than Poland. And then after Poland, Russia, biggest country. Easy dub, thank you very much. And that'll give me an easy next point too, because I just click Russia again. Ooh, Tunisia is quite a small one, so this could be difficult. Finland. I think I would go with Finland. Yeah, 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 Finland, there you go. It's, a, it's like it's two times bigger kind of thing. Turkey, Finland, I think I'll go Finland again, thank you. Oh my god, Turkey is so much bigger than I thought. And now James Corden's all ragged up about it, so let's just move on. Slithering Outlines, I, I did a video, a dedicated video on this like a while ago, and I really enjoyed it, so I want to just play this again. Okay, that is USA, easy. <clears throat> so yeah, it's just about recognising the countries. Oh, we've got some straight lines. Canada? Maybe? No. Oh, no. Why? Well, I don't know why I said Canada. Actually, no, it's not a crazy guess, is it? Because of the way the US borders it on each side. Where is that? Mali? Mauritania? I feel like I struggled with this one before. We'll, we'll have to skip it for now. That one I do recognize as India. <clears throat> and then next is... Whoa, that's a wiggle. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be typing Mali again, aren't I? Yes, <laughs> it's time to write. I feel like I just always say Mali. That is Chile. Thank you. What was the second one? The second one was so tricky. Okay, what's this? How long have we got left? <gasps> the final six minutes. Ooh. I do not know. Yeah, I, I am not sure on that one. We'll, we'll come back to it. This is a wild, wacky shape. Croatia, maybe? Let's try it. Yes, thank you. It's so weird, this. It, like, it, <laughs> it's a real struggle. So you just have to sit and watch it for a bit, do its thing. All right, it's, uh, that's going to be Senegal, I believe. Yeah, look at that. That's some geography knowledge. Um, struggling with the shape of this one. Actually, I don't think I am. I think that's Vietnam. Oh, fantastic. And I made a rhyme. We've got some wiggles and then some stray bits and then some wiggles again. Jeez, that's, that's a bit of a crazy one. What the? What is that? Is it Iceland? It is. Okay. So it's just the two that I didn't know. So due to the time limitations, I'll give up. Egypt. I bet a lot of people got Egypt. And then South Africa, because we've got the little exclave from Lesotho. Or Esotini. No. Yeah, it would be, it would be Esotini, I think. Would it? I don't know. I can't think of it right now. All right. Well, we'll play our final one. Capitals of Europe. And how long have I got to name them? Five minutes till the timer ends. I think <laughs> it's capitals. I thought it was just naming countries of Europe, which I could have smashed. But capitals I'm going to struggle with. All right. Capital of Russia. 
Moscow, Liechtenstein, Vaduz, uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina. We'll come back to it. Let's just see how far we can get. Serbia, Bel Belgrade. That was the first thing we did earlier. France, Paris, uh, Turkey is Ankara. Then we've got Copenhagen, uh, Lithuania, Tallinn. No, yeah, is it is it Tallinn? Tallinn, Lithuania. Vilnius, yes, Slovakia, Ljubljana, Ljub, Ljena. No, Bratislava then, Bratislava. Yes, Ljubljana must be Slovenia. Poland is Warsaw, Bulgaria is Sofia, Andorra's Andorra La Vella, Greece is Athens, uh, Rome, Malta is Nicosia, is it not? No, um, Cyprus is Nicosia. Malta is Valletta. Valletta? Two, yeah, two Ts. Austria. Oh, I get these mixed up. Zagreb? No. Prague. It's Prague. No, it's v it's Vienna. Vienna. <laughs> Slovenia. Lejub. Lejena. There you go. Oslo. Cyprus. Nicosia. <clears throat> Lisbon. Uh, Brussels. Monaco, just Monaco again. Vatican is just Vatican again. There you go. Sweden is Stockholm. Uh, Estonia. Is that Tallinn? <laughs> yes, it is. Hungary is... Why do I not just know Hungary straight away? It's Budapest, isn't it? Or is it... Bu yeah, Budapest. Netherlands is Amsterdam. North Macedonia. S Skopje. Yep, Montenegro. Ooh. Gonna have to come back to you. Luxembourg is Luxembourg City. Or just Luxembourg. It's Czechia. Is that Zagreb? I think so. Ah, <laughs> it's Prague, isn't it? Prague! There you go. Finland. Helsinki. I know such obscure ones, but then I get all the obvious ones mixed up. Ireland is Dublin. How long have I got left? Two minutes, 40 seconds till it's been an hour. What an adventure we have had. Switzerland is Bern. Latvia is... I don't know. I can't remember. Moldova. Ooh. Chisinau. Oh, beautiful. Kiev. There you go. Spain is Madrid. San Marino. San Marino again. Yep. UK is London. Croatia is Zagreb. Zagreb. There you go. Germany is... Why have I just forgot Germany? It's it's obvious. Berlin, obviously, Jack. Kosovo. Is that Pristina? Yes. And then Reykjavik. <laughs> Can I spell it? Ray Reykjavik. Reykjavik. <laughs> Reykjavik. 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 Yeah. I'll just keep spelling it wrong over and over the same way. Romania. Bucharest. Belarus is Minsk. There you go. Albania. Hmm. Not Skopje. That's North Macedonia. Okay, it's not coming to me. Bosnia, so I think that's just the ones that I've skipped now. <clears throat> so how many can I think of in the next 50 seconds and then our timer is up? I don't think so. I feel, why can't I not spell Reykjavik? Rek... Yavik. Rek... <laughs> Rek... <laughs> I just keep spelling it the same way. Okay, that's fine. Albania, I feel like I know... But I just, I can't get it. And Bosnia too. And yeah, all of these I've learned, but I just cannot remember them. So do you know what? Let's give up. What were the answers? Riga, Tirana, Podgosia, and Sarajevo. Oh, and there's Reykjavik. It's the J. I've missed the J each time. That's what went wrong. Oh, what a shame. But just like that, we are on the final 
Four seconds. Let's just sit and wait for it. What an adventure we have had. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching this geography video. Oh my god. Do you know what? Uh, Kai, make sure we do not include that alarm noise because it will probably wake everyone up. Instead, just, just completely mute it. <laughs> oh my god, can you imagine? Alright, thank you for watching. Uh, let me know if you want me to do more videos like this. I, I think people just enjoy just having something there that they can watch in the background. Uh, we did okay as well. I definitely need to uh, improve because I've not got the best scores overall. Let's just have a look through them. 89%, that one we did well. 93%, 100 98%, uh, we won't talk about that one. 87%, uh, 60 yeah, that's like 70%, 100%, 75%, 73%, 37 out of 50. Do you know what? Actually, we didn't do too badly. We did okay. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.